Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a crucial question for developers working with NPM. Our viewer is looking for the best practice for upgrading their NPM pre-published script for versions greater than or equal to four. Let's dive into the details. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully getting you to that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and get through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. To upgrade your NPM pre-published script for NPM version four and above, we need to understand the changes in how NPM handles scripts. Starting with NPM version five, the pre-published script will only run during NPM publish. To maintain compatibility with NPM version 3, we can use both the prepare and pre-publish scripts. This way, the build steps will run for both NPM install and NPM publish, ensuring that users with NPM version 3 can still build the project. If you want to enforce a minimum NPM version requirement, you can add a check in your scripts. This can be done by creating a separate script that checks the NPM version before proceeding with the build steps. Finally, you can combine these approaches. Use the check NPM script to ensure the correct version is being used and set up both pre-publish and prepare scripts to handle builds for different NPM versions. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To upgrade your NPM pre-published script for NPM version 4 and above, remember that the Engines field only throws errors when your package is installed as a dependency, unless the Engine strict flag is set. As a developer, you won't see alerts from this field. Since you need to compile files only during NPM install, consider using the post install hook instead of pre-publish. Note that pre-publish will still exist, but will only run before the publish hook in NPM version 5. And that's it guys. I hope we've gone through the question and found that solution you're looking for. And look, if we did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.